Well, hey there, church family. This is Pastor Jay with the weekly update. Today is October 15th. Uh, before I get into the weekly update, I want to just make sure you are aware. Uh, tomorrow night at 6 p.m. is the L.D. Bell High School Homecoming Parade, which goes right in front of our church at, on uh, Bedford Eulis Road and then also on Hurstview. And so getting to church tomorrow night might be an adventure. It's not normally on Wednesday night, but it is this year. And so I want to give you the heads up so you're in the know. Uh, may have to do some rerouting to get here, but we hope that you're able to make it in a timely manner to church uh, tomorrow night. Our Shady Oaks Homecoming is going to be on November 16th from noon to 2. Uh, this is going to be an opportunity that's part of our Kingdom Legacy campaign where we're trying to reach out to people who used to go to Shady Oaks. Uh, and so I want you to invite your friends, I want to invite your prodigals to come back. Maybe you have some friends that used to go here or maybe don't go to church anywhere. Uh, or maybe you have people in the area that you know don't go to church. This is an opportunity to invite them to uh, fr- uh, live music, free food, and free games to have a great time fellowshipping together and getting to know a little bit about Shady Oaks in the, in the process. And so I want to make you guys aware of this. And so this is not an event that the staff is doing and y'all show up. This is an event that we're doing as a church. We want you to invite people to come and invite them to the Shady Oaks homecoming on November 16th. We're doing a community Thanksgiving meal this year on Thanksgiving Day from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. And we need you to volunteer to be a part of this. Uh, there's uh, a large number of people that we're hoping to come and be a part of this, reaching out to the various groups and agencies and, and asking for uh, letting people know that we're doing this. And we want to make sure that you know about that. But there's also a need for some food. And so they need green beans, they need corn, they need instant potatoes, they need dressing or stuffing mix, they need canned cranberry sauce, rolls, cookies, and if you want to donate money for Turkey, you would also take that money to do that. And so uh, you'll begin to see posters around the church where you can drop those things off. Uh, but I just want to make sure that you know that uh, we're going to have some needs for this because we're hoping it's going to be a very successful day uh, of inviting people to come and ex- experience Thanksgiving meal together. October is generally Pastor Appreciation Month. Well, we here at Shady Oaks, we do minister appreciation. We want to let them know that we love and appreciate them. But because of the work going on in our sanctuary, we've kind of pushed it back a little bit. And so this past Sunday was the beginning of it. It's going to run in through uh, November 10th. And uh, there's tables set up with boxes, uh, cards for you to write to the different ministers, and you can drop those in the boxes. There's also going to be some lists on each table of their favorites, and you can take that list and maybe purchase some things for them, or maybe use a class, you can get your class together and do a little basket together with their favorites, or whatever you want to do. We want to give you an opportunity to, to tell our staff and their ministers how much you appreciate them. Again, this goes on until the 10th of November. This coming Sunday, we're going to be in Acts chapter 18, and we're talking about building trellises and build, and growing vines. And uh, we're taking a look at what Paul says about this and how we need to be taking a look at a different perspective on some things. And I know there's a lot more that you have no idea what I'm talking about. Well, tune in Sunday morning. I'll answer uh, more about what building trellises and, build, and growing vines really is for us as a church and what we need to be thinking about. I hope that you guys have a great, great day, and we'll see you on Sunday.